Winter weather made for a dramatic river rescue underneath the Monroe Street Bridge this afternoon. KXOI 4's Annie Bishop is live near the Monroe Street Bridge. Annie, what happened? Well, it was a rescue that involved a gondola here at Riverfront Park and the quick actions of the Spokane Fire Department. Now, it all started just after 3 o'clock when someone in the library across the river spotted a man in the water underneath the Monroe Street Bridge. Now, that person called 911, which led to this rescue. Now, once crews arrived, the man was able to pull himself out of the water, but unable to make it up the slippery rocks above. Crews lowered a rope and within 20 minutes, the man in his 20s pulled himself to safety. At that point, crews quickly wrapped him up in a blanket and carefully loaded him into a nearby gondola. Battalion Chief Steve Sabo says rescue crews train on the gondola year round for all different scenarios, including what unfolded here today. It worked out well. It, it was a perfect location for us, and uh, it definitely was the best option uh, other than trying to, you know, it certainly would have been better than trying to haul him up the bank. That would have been a technical rescue. That would have involved a lot of rope work and a lot more time. And Sabo believes the man was heavily intoxicated and may be homeless. He told crews that he slipped into the rocks, or into the water that is, while walking along the river. Uh, he was taken by ambulance to a local hospital where we were told that he is expected to be just fine. Reporting live, Annie Bishop, KXLY4 HD News.